Hi, I'm Nick Barnes, Machine Shop Manager at John Force Racing. Here to talk to you today about some of the parts we make here out of TMS Titanium Materials. Um, some of the parts that we make here uh, using the materials are flywheels, pressure plates, pressure plate covers. Um, we start out you know, using a blank of material like this to create our flywheels. And we end up with a finished product like this. And it takes about seven hours to create a flywheel to make one from start to finish. We use Hengstifer's S787 in our machines. Um, that is a really, really good coolant. Um, it has a lot of good cooling properties. So when we machine the titanium, if you've machined it before, you get a lot of heat in your part, a lot of heat in your tool. When you use a carbide tool and you get heat, you know, you get stress fractures and cracks and you wear a lot of tools. So with this, we can run an end mill for 30 minutes, 45 minutes, and grab a hold of it when it's done and it's ice cold as well as the part. And we don't get a whole lot of um, color variation from heat in the material as well. So here on the titanium, we use a lot of five flute, six flute, and seven flute end mills to, to machine the titanium. We use five flute extended or seven flute extended end mills like these to walk around the part to clean everything up. We use full depth cutting. We go full depth, smaller step overs, faster feed rates. Obviously you can go a lot faster with a seven flute than you can a five flute, but your step over is a lot smaller. So, but you can really go a lot faster with the seven flutes. We go about 125 inches a minute versus around 75 inches a minute. We also use six flute end mills as well to do a lot of the dynamic milling pocketing inside the flywheel or the cover or the pressure plate. Um, we also have a lot of tooling that we have to use that's reamers, carbide drills, custom boring heads to really complete you know, the crank bore and all these bores, everything on these parts are very highly tolerant. You know, we're trying to complete you know, plus or minus two tenths on some of these holes. When we machine the titanium here, um, we use a lot of dynamic milling cutting tool paths. Um, there's a lot of material that has to come off the part and we used to actually cut, you know, depth cuts and cut the piece out and there was a chunk in the middle. Now we use a lot of dynamic milling which is faster feed rate, full depth, to really get rid of the material in a lot quicker time. So we use master cam on that with the dynamic milling and it really gets rid of a lot of material in a hurry. We're out here in our machine shop. This is the machine we make our TMS titanium flywheels on. Um, we make our pressure plates and our covers on the same fixture as well. Um, this is obviously the billet on the fixture to start op one process. Um, and when we're done, this is our TMS flywheel titanium part. We're happy to use TMS titanium. Um, we, we get the material in a timely manner and never have had an issue with any material that we've gotten from them. Everything's always been really, really well, really good.